Hi, this video is from interview.com. Interview.com is a job portal. In this video, I am going to talk about Stack Overflow Error in Java. Before that, what is Stack Memory? Stack Memory is used to store local variables and function calls. In Java, there are two memories, Heap Memory and Stack Memory. Heap Memory is used to store the objects whenever you create and Stack Memory is for storing the local variables and function call. Each thread in Java has their own stack which can be specified using x, yes, yes, Java JVM parameter. If there is no memory left in stack for storing function call or local variables, Java virtual machine will throw java.lang.stack overflow error. Variables stored in stacks are only visible to the owner thread. So usually the stack overflow error will happen whenever you make a recursion call, recursive call. JVM exception, exceptions, those exceptions are errors that are either exclusively most logically thrown by JVM. Example, stack overflow error null point exception. I have written a very simple code which is going to simulate stack overflow error. So I am I am calling this method keep calling. Okay and I am creating an object local object and I am catching the stack overflow error this is not recommended to catch to catch stack overflow error but for demo purpose I am doing it I am going to start the debugging now let's see how exactly it works whether it throws stack for flow overflow error or not let's see can you see that it has called the method recursively so many times this method and this statement was printed it has called so many times and we have got the stack overflow error that means the stack memory has been exhausted okay so this is how so how can we avoid stack for overflow error you have to terminate your recursive method appropriately otherwise stack overflow error will happen hope this video is useful thank you and all the best